Hello everyone, this is Sayed Rola, associated with Cell Infotech Private Limited as a SAP Business Objects Senior Consultant. Today I will walk through SAP's Business Objects Excelsior Solution Overview. Presenting Business Information. Today's business data with its rows and columns of numbers and static charts rarely excite or inform decision makers. Excelsius presents If effective data presentation is an art, then Excelsius lets you create a masterpiece. Bring spreadsheets to life. Turn interactive into actions. Steal the show. On the left hand side, we have the Excel sheet for which we have built a beautiful dashboard. Very interactive for sales analysis by region. For North America. Just by dragging and dropping a pointer on the dashboard you can see the percentage of sales region wise for North America for Latin America Europe Asia Pacific and the corporate we have the charts the bar graph here for actuals and budgets and we also have the overall sales. We can also turn the interactive into actions by doing some sort of calculations according to your business requirements. User inputs, uh, this is a what if analysis, a very interactive calculator that has been built using Excel shares. Can give you formulas, can give you values here that accordingly will change the values and you can do your profit and loss here. You have the results per unit, the margin, fixed cost, and the losses. And you have a chart showing fixed cost, total cost, and total revenues. We also set minimum and maximum in this calculator as a threshold values. Stealing the show is nothing but showing a very good visualization dashboard, a different predicted sales growth in US, which is very interactive, which shows your annual sales and accordingly what are your marketing expenses. By different regions like US, Italy, Switzerland, Norway, England and Germany. So Excelsius presents. Excelsius uses Microsoft Excel as its foundation to deliver a complete data presentation. Solutions. Microsoft Excel has data presentation, data analysis and manipulations. Excel shares adds the values like interactive, drill down, animated charts, gauges, maps, sliders and more. On the fly, what if analysis, on click, export options, stunning visualizations. It's very easy to work. It's a three step ahead to just export to your favorite documents like Microsoft and Adobe PDF. In the step one, you need to just input your tabular data directly into Excel Shares or import an existing Excel spreadsheet. In the step two, point and click to create an interactive data presentation. In the step three is just export to Microsoft Office or Adobe PDF. The key features of Excelsius are 
visual modeling which involves quickly evaluate multiple what if scenarios thought and click is excel sheet initiative interface make is easy for non technical users to create interactive data presentation we don't need to spend on trainings to the end users one click export options microsoft office and adobe pdf no programming knowledge required only basic excel skills need in order to use it dozens of visualization components animated charts sliders gauges progress bars map maps menus skins and more now i am going to show you a real time dashboards which we have built for a transmission company the first one is for plant maintenance dashboard here the end users are monitoring the overall cities transmission on the top you have availability of the system lines connected with the substations lines connected to 80 substations is the overall transmission loss on the scale of 0 to 2 here is the chart of the city where we have different substations by selecting a individual substation we can see different calculations like availability of the system the percentage is 99.85 and then we have lines connected with substations so 99.58 lines connected at the substations it's 87.88 we can also see number of breakdowns not repaired within 4 hours on a scale of 0 to 10 we have 5 here and number of breakdown notifications on a scale of 0 to 10 9 so percentage of transmission loss is 2.15 when we have the another dashboard built for material management with respective purchasing and inventory here we have closing stock and projected stock with respect to quantities and values we can measure this with different substations on the left hand side the substations if we select the substation we can have the total overall closing stock versus projected stock in terms of quantity and values then we have the purchasing the tab second one which has plant and purchasing groups so this plant are the list of plants on the left hand side and we have purchase orders created during current month with respect to different substations we have purchase order value in lakhs and po count we just drag and drop a pointer here we can see the number of purchase order counts and the value and we have the purchase requisitions created during current month where we have PR values in lakhs and PR count. These are the number of purchase requisitions created during the month. These charts are respect to plant, and we can also do the analysis respect to purchasing groups. These are the list of purchasing groups we have for this organization, and we can see the purchase order created during current month of different purchase order types. Purchase order legacy. We have purchase order values. and purchase order counts the last one we have the hcm dashboard which has human capital management which deals with here we have designed this dashboard with respect to different age category employee group employee sub group and genders to count on the head count the attrition the promotions and the transfer orders to select the age i have the 
chart which shows the percentage of headcount with different ages and I have the attrition with the respective age and the promotions and the transfer orders then I have the category with respect to headcount attrition transfer orders and promotions I have employee groups headcount deputations doctors regular just by dragging and dropping your mouse pointer you can see the percentage and the count with the headcount with respect to attrition transfer orders and promotions we have employee subgroup which has a chart here explaining about professionals technical professionals with different groups subgroups a b c and d and others with respect to headcounts attrition's transfer orders and promotions Finally, we have the gender, where we have number of male employees and number of female employees with respect to headcount, attrition, transfer orders, and promotions, which help the HR department just by monitoring this to get the complete details of their organization. With this, I'll close this presentation. Thank you, everyone.